As you can tell, it's post toasties. <laughs> You're about to go on the last tour of an American industrial giant. For more than 110 years, the smelter in El Paso, Texas drove the region's economy. But few people ever saw what went on inside. Our cameras were allowed in just before the smelter's demolition began in the summer of 2010. This building that we are sitting in right now, if it was in operation, we wouldn't dare be sitting here. Oh, no. It was so loud, fire would be belching out of the converters, there would be pouring uh, mat over here, the cranes would be running back and forth. The only one that was allowed on this floor was a crane chaser. Our guides were two retired employees. They showed us a view of the smelter that few had seen and no one will ever see again. Oh, beautiful. What do you got here? Oh, uh, you're gonna see inside the furnace now. All this here that you see right here, that's blister copper. Is, that, is this one of the furnaces that rotates? Yes, this is a converter, furnace number two. And as you can see, there's some accretion built up inside the furnace. Uh. Okay. Okay, we're gonna go ahead and take a two-minute breather. Uh. 